Until next time, unpacking a common English phrase. Hello, everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into a popular English phrase, until next time. This phrase is often heard in casual conversations, movies, and even in professional settings. Understanding its meaning and usage can add a natural touch to your English communication. So, let's get started. The phrase, until next time, is used as a farewell statement. Literally, it means, until we meet or interact again. But, there's more to it than just the literal meaning. Figuratively, it conveys a sense of ongoing connection and the anticipation of future interaction. It's a way of saying goodbye without a definite time frame, keeping the door open for future meetings or communications. Until next time, is versatile and can be used in various scenarios. Casual settings, among friends or acquaintances, it's a light-hearted way to say goodbye. Professional contexts, in work-related situations, it can add a friendly tone while maintaining professionalism. Digital communications, often used in emails, chat messages, or even at the end of videos or podcasts. Remember, the tone of voice and body language can alter its perceived meaning. A cheerful tone suggests positivity and looking forward to the next meeting, while a more subdued tone might convey a routine farewell. This phrase is commonly used in English-speaking cultures, symbolizing a relaxed and friendly attitude. However, it's interesting to note the variations. See you next time, more direct, emphasizing the visual aspect of meeting again. Catch you later, more casual and colloquial. Till we meet again, slightly more formal and poetic. Understanding these variations helps in choosing the right phrase for the right situation. So, that's all about, until next time, it's a simple yet meaningful phrase that adds a personal touch to your farewells. We hope this video helps you in using it confidently in your conversations. Until next time, keep practicing, and happy learning!